Did you know it takes ten days for civilization to collapse? Yeah. You take away a man's basic needs and he will revert to his primordial instincts in just ten days. <laughs> That's a difficult thing to understand unless you've lived it. Well, I was in Iraq during the first Gulf War. 82nd Airborne All-Americans. Hoorah! <laughs> One night there was a, an ambush. And me and this guy named Miller got separated from the unit. No food. No radio. Nearest base, 200 clicks to the south, so we just started walking. Well, by the third day I knew we were lost. Day six, ran out of water. You know what that's like, don't you? Difficult to swallow. On the seventh day, Miller's legs started going all wonky. Did you know your brain starts to eat your muscles in order to survive? That's why you're so goddamn skinny. And by the eighth day, the wolves were closing in. And I looked at Miller and I could tell we were as good as dead. And I accepted that. And in that acceptance, See, I wasn't just looking at Miller. I was looking at an opportunity. It wasn't something I wanted. It was something that I had to do. It was... It was my test. You see, Miller's sacrifice wasn't about me walking out of that desert. It was about bringing me here. We have their purpose. You'll understand that soon enough. the herd. Sacrifice the weak.
Wake up. Rock. I'm gonna get you out of here, okay? And we're gonna get out of here, okay? Only you. Only you. Hey, what about me? What about me? You aren't strong enough. You have to get out of here before it starts again. Follow me. Studied the route for weeks. It's the only way out. You'll be safe if you don't. You're gone.